without further ado, we're going to be testing sugar wax. Okay, so if you haven't heard of sugar wax before, sugar wax is pretty much like normal wax that you use to remove hair. So you apply it to your skin and then you rip it off. The only thing is with sugar wax is that it's completely natural. And if you look it up on the internet, which I spent a long time doing, it's just a ton of reasons why it's better than normal wax. Not only that, apparently, it hurts less than normal wax, which is why I wanted to test it. With sugar wax, you can use it in two different ways. So if you use it when it's warm, you can like apply it and then apply fabric on top and rip it off, which is the same way that normal wax works. Or you can wait until it's solid and then apply it that way, which is the part I'm probably most excited to do because it looks really exciting. And I have my recipe here <laughs> on this tiny little piece of paper. It says one three fourths cup of sugar. So I have here, some pure cane granulated sugar. Then it says a quarter cup of lemon. So I bought some lemon juice and then a quarter cup of water. Oh, and I haven't told you, one of my legs, this one, I do not want you to see that up close. One of my legs is very hairy right now. It's, I'm not happy about it, but I wanted to make sure that I tested this properly for you. So I have one lovely smooth leg and one leg that really, really hopes that this DIY works. So we're going to head downstairs now. We're going to mix the ingredients into a saucepan. We're going to boil it on medium heat until it goes to kind of a caramel brownish color. And then we're going to take it off the heat and wait for it to cool. That's the plan. So I'm going to pour some of my wax onto this baking tray in the hopes that it will cool a little quicker and we can start playing with it. Dry faster. Ew, ow hot. I'm going to wait a little bit longer. I'm going to be a little bit more patient. Mm. This is so annoying. To get, right, okay, that's, that's going to have to do. It says to play with this until it goes like a lot whiter and lighter in colour. So as you can see, it's quite dark brown. And it says to do this. Oh, it's still nice and warm. I thought this would be a lot more sticky. I thought it would be over my hands more, but my hands are actually like completely clean. Getting lighter in color. I'm doing it. I've done something right. Something, come on, this has to work. Oh, moment of truth. I'm going to get my leg out. So I'm going to apply against the growth of hair because that seemed to be the more popular option. Apply some baby powder, make it nice and smooth. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I never thought I'd be doing this on YouTube. I don't think this is gonna work, you know? I really don't. It doesn't feel like it's even sticky in the slightest. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm so nervous. So you're supposed to push and go against your hair. And then you're like meant to lift up. <sighs> Painful, lift up this end bit and then like go over it again. Oh my goodness, I can't rip this off. I'm so scared. I can't do this. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna have a panic attack. <laughs> Guys, I'm so scared, I can't do this. Pull the skin taut. I'm so scared. Okay, we ready for this? I'm not ready for this. Oh, that hurts like hell. lots of hairs in it let me show you can you see that can you see those hairs like sticking up from there ew gross okay so it pulled out a ton of hairs but there's still loads of hairs left like on my leg like loads of them okay so you're then meant to just use it again although i feel like this has gone really solid Oh, it's not even sticking, it's just rolling off. <sighs> I can't. <sighs> Ew! Ew, <laughs> there are so many hairs in there. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Okay, so it works, not excellently, but I think that might be my fault. I think I cooked it too long. One, two. Oh. Ew. But see, there's loads of hairs left still. I don't think I made this right. I think I failed. I think that's my fault, so. Okay, we're going to move on to the liquid form. So in here, there is liquid stuff. They said not to test how hot it was on your finger because it gets stuck to your finger. So I'm gonna test it on my tongue. 
hot. That is still very hot. Um, so this is the wax that I've just played with and then I have a new lump of wax which is still quite warm but we're gonna try we're gonna try the hard wax again. This this is more of what I thought it was going to be like first time. It's very very stuck to me. Leg is out. I feel like this one worked a lot better so now it says you flick up the end like this so you've got something to hold on to. Ha ha okay one two Oh, ooh, that worked a ton better, guys. <gasps> guys, this is working, aside from two teeny little hairs. I have a patch of hairless skin. Ooh, look, the hair's gone. Guys, this is amazing. I'm kind of addicted to this. Like, the pain is bad for half a second and then it's completely gone. Okay, I think I'm done with the solid wax. We're going to move on to liquid wax. Okay, I'm just gonna test how hot or cold this is. So, one second. Mmm. It tastes like a toffee apple. Ooh, that is warm. And there's a lot of hairs in there that I can see. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm terrified right now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I don't want to do this. Oh my gosh, I could see so many hairs through that. I'm so scared. Okay, I'm doing this for you guys. Okay, ready? One, two. Oh, that hurts so much more than the other one, but there are lots of hairs in there. Okay, this way works a ton better. That is gross. I will show you. I don't know if you can see all of the hairs in there. Like, ew. Okay, I'm not kidding now. I'm ever so slightly addicted to doing this. Like, it hurts, but for such a short amount of time and then your leg is so smooth afterwards. It's just so smooth. Okay, so it's official. I'm switching over to sugar wax from here on 